As promised, UK climber Ben Davison is going to show us part one of his advanced training programme on today's Climbing Daily. I'm Ben Davison and I'm going to tell you about my warm-up routine for a hard training session. So I like to start my warm-ups with some lumbar and thoracic spine mobility. The lumbar exercise involves lying on your back with your arms out to the side, your shoulders pinned to the floor and feet on the floor and your knees bent. And then just rotate your knees to each side eight times, keeping your shoulders pinned down without rotating your hips too much. The thoracic exercise involves going on your hands and knees with one hand against your temple and just rotate your elbow towards the ceiling eight times each side without rotating your hips. The next exercise is to mobilize your shoulders. I do this using a, a broomstick. I just hold the broomstick straight above my head in both hands, lift it up above your head and then draw it back over your shoulders, keeping your arms straight. You'll feel your shoulders pinch together and just hold it there and keep moving in and out of that position. To make the broomstick exercise harder, bring your hands closer together and to make it easier, put your hands further apart. The first exercise to warm up your shoulders is external rotators. This involves lying on your side on the ground with your elbow against your side and then keeping your back straight and your hips stable, rotate your hand towards the ceiling. You can do this with a very light weight, but you won't need much weight at all. The second exercise to warm up your shoulders is rotator cuffs. Uh, this involves standing up, holding a light weight, put your elbow out at shoulder height and bent at 90 degrees and then rotate your hand towards the ceiling. I like to do eight to 12 reps of these exercises. The final exercise to warm up your shoulder is thoracic activation. This involves lying on your side, holding a moderately heavy weight, maybe a few kilos above your head, and then draw that weight back over your sho shoulder with a straight arm until you feel your shoulders pinch together. To mobilize your hips, I like to do lunges. This involves getting into a standard lunge position, but making sure that your pelvis is tucked in beneath your shoulders and that your back is straight. To make the stretch more intense, push your hips forward and lift your arms above your head. You can also bounce gently in and out of the stretch. I like to hold this for at least 15 seconds, but probably not more than a minute. So now that we've mobilized the hips, we're gonna strengthen them to make you better at high steps. The exercise I like to do for this involves tying a TheraBand around your feet lying on your back with your legs straight and then one at a time drawing your knees as far as you can towards your chest and holding it in that position for a few seconds. I like to do eight reps on each side. So now that we've mobilized our hips and our back and warmed up our shoulders, ready to do some easy climbing and then next time I'll show you some harder antagonistic exercises. Thanks Ben. Stay tuned for more of this series coming soon. That's all for today. Thanks for watching Climbing Daily.